Hey guys and welcome to this studio vlog. Hello if you're new here and if you are returning to my channel. So I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to be doing in this video. Uh, I think it's going to be a little bit all over the place but I'm excited to be doing it because I think it's been a while since I've had a video where I've kind of just done a lot of random things and I've had no actual plan for the month. So today I'm going to be working on painting a denim jacket. I'm going away to a festival with some friends and I just wanted a new denim jacket to take with me and I kind of just wanted to make it a little bit fancy um, and have some fun with it. It is currently Sunday and I'm going away on Thursday so I've really really not got a huge amount of time to get it done. I'm going to spend as much time on it as possible to get it sorted and ready but it is possible that I won't get it done um, but I am aiming to anyway. Because I'm going away I also have to fit in my part time job work uh, alongside that too so it's going to be a bit of a squeeze to fit all those normal hours in a shorter week um, as well as get this done. Um, and also do my usual like packing orders and little bits and pieces that I need to do for the shop uh, So I've not got a huge amount of time, but I'm gonna figure out a way to make it work I also got accepted into Comic Con for October, which I am so excited about I've got so much more time to prepare for it than I did last time in May I only found out about four or five weeks before the event so I really didn't have long but I've got a long long time now to get everything sat sorted um, so that's kind of a bit more of a relief. Other than that I'm not really sure about what I'll be working on. Um, I'll be doing my usual part-time job stuff that I never really show and I'm also currently working on a children's book commission but again I'm not going to show that because it's not personal stuff. Um, but anyway I hope you do enjoy this video whatever we end up getting up to. So I'm going to get out some paints uh, and get set up with sorting out this jacket. That doesn't feel very good. If I could tell you, I don't think you believe how long I felt this way. I'm begging you to stay And if I could show you I'd hope that you could see All the possibilities There could be a place for you and me And under the stars You pack up your car Cause you're going far away from
So I have a little bit of an update. So I am moving temporarily for my part-time job. Um, I'm now actually freelance, so I'm not actually officially employed anymore. Um, and we are launching just a huge, big, huge new project um, at, for, for two different businesses actually. Um, and I'm gonna be working on that and it just makes more sense for me to move a little bit closer, kind of get as much stuff done as possible and get it all sorted and set up properly. There's gonna be a few things I'm gonna need to learn. So I think it's just a lot easier if I'm actually there for the month. So I will still be posting content because I have a bit of a backlog for videos at the moment. So it will be good for my YouTube channel at least because I'll have the time to sit down and edit some videos. But I'm gonna be leaving pretty much all of my Polygon stuff here, including my products, um, things I need to make stuff. Um, I could move it with me, but there's just so much stuff and it's only for a month, so there's not really a huge amount of a point of doing it. Um, it's just so much to move in such a small space that I'm not gonna be able to fit any of it in. And it's just a lot of effort, so I'm not gonna be taking anything with me other than my computer and I'm filming bits and pieces. I will be coming home at the weekend, so my orders will still be going out. My mum will also be packing them up for me too, so that should all be mostly smoothly done and fine. Um, a few things might be affected, like a couple of sublimation of things that I haven't got printed, but I'll get back to that in a minute. Um, and custom orders. Custom orders are gonna be the biggest thing that they will take a little bit longer to get out, but I'll still get them out as soon as possible. And I think at the moment anyway, my shipping deadline for them is like two or three weeks anyway. So it's not really gonna be increased that much anyway. Um, I am a super, super speedy really. And I'm usually a lot faster than three weeks and I usually get stuff out within a day or so, but um, it is gonna slow down just a little bit but I don't think anyone's gonna notice that. Um, I will put a notice up on my website and my Etsy and on my Instagram and Facebook and stuff, so everyone will know by now anyway, but um, yeah, it's just gonna be a little bit, little bit all over the place for a while. I do have Comic Con coming up at the end of October, so I'm really not gonna have much time to get ready for that. So I'm gonna try and squeeze as much as I physically can into this next week or so, well, next five days until I go, and then I still gotta pack and get everything ready. Um, I thankfully don't have a huge amount of stuff to do for Comic Con, um, because I'm kind of building up a good amount of stock. There was a bunch of things I needed to order, so I placed a huge Vogue Grace order, so all that stuff will be with me in the next month or so, and it will probably arrive after I come home anyway. I'm gonna be away from around the 14th of August to the 14th of September, give or take a few days of it here or there. So Comic Con is at the end of October, so I'll have half of September and most of October to get ready for it anyway so I don't think that is too much of a worry. Um, I will be doing a different layout because I'll be having two tables but again that'll be something I worry closer to the time whether or not I was going to be away for the next month. I am however going to try and get my sublimation stuff printed before I go minus the Animal Crossing socks. The reason for that is so if someone places an order with any of these products, sublimation products and I don't have them in stock my mum won't be able to send them away and it'll be a bit more of a faff for me to restock while I'm um, back home just for the weekend. So I'm gonna get that them done as soon as possible. Animal Crossing socks is a little bit different because if people place an order for them, there'll be different characters to what I offer anyway and they'll have their own unique colorway. They will take be one of the products that take a little bit longer because they are completely custom. Yeah, so I've got some cushions and tote bags to restock. I think there are some sock, other normal socks as well I need to restock but well, I've got enough around that I probably won't bother doing them until I do all the other socks. Mugs, I'm pretty happy with how many I've got that are with them. I'm all up to date with them. I've got plenty. Um, I didn't really take that many to Hyper Japan and I didn't sell that many, so I've got so many left over for Comic Con, which is great because mugs sold quite well there. Things like adding charms to key rings and stuff, well, I don't have to cut charms, so I'll have to do them when I come back. Uh, I've also got some bracelets and necklaces and things to make, but I'll do one then when I get back too. So, yeah, the next few days I'm just going to be pretty much printing cushions and tote bags. I think there's a few prints I want to restock as well. Um, I need to package up some more of my duck prints, fox prints, and there's probably something else that I can't remember off the top of my head. So they will need doing, and if I have the time, I will do them before I go, just because it's a little thing that I can just quickly get sorted. 
But other than that, um, yeah, I'm feeling pretty sorted for co for Comic Con. I do think taking a month out is probably going to add a little bit of stress, but I think I'm pretty prepared anyway that I should be alright. Um, I do want to design some new products, but these are ones that I can do while I'm away and then order um, just before Comic Con. So I want to make some Barbie stickers um, of Barbie, and so I'll draw them out while I'm away and then I can cut them out with my machine myself when I get back. I'm also thinking of designing some lanyards so I can order them pretty easily through Vogue Grace. I'll design them while I'm away and order them, that's easy. Um, and I also want to get some new uh, Keshapon designs done for some new keyrings. At the moment I think I've only got maybe like five keyrings left, so I think it would be really good to have some new designs there. And I'll have two, the two side by side so people can pick between them until the other one has sold out. Pretty much getting the big things out of the way and the things that I need to get sorted um, so I have stock here in case we need to suddenly ship stuff out quickly. So I'm gonna start printing things out and start sublimating. And I hope you guys stick around over the next month or so, which is gonna be a little over the place, but you probably won't even notice because I'll have even more time to spend on making YouTube videos and other content. So it might even be a good thing in the end. Um, I just won't really be able to work on making a huge amount of new products that I would make in the studio that I would personally make rather than send off to get made, but I don't think that's the end of the world because I'm trying to reduce the amount of stock I've got anyway. Um, so, uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop talking now and get into printing stuff. I've just remembered one more thing before I go. Um, I also wanna do a shop update. I've got a very small amount of products I need adding to my shop teeny tiny amount um, but I'm gonna take those photos anyway and get them sorted so I can do the update while I'm away um, I only have to take a photo of a few things most stuff I've already taken photos of so that makes it super easy for me um, I can't even remember what's on the list I know there's definitely fox pins um, I need to take photos of them I've also got to put the t-shirts up but I've also got, but I've already got the photos of t-shirts sorted so that's super easy um, what else oh yeah a duck cushion and a duck tote bag duck cushion and a duck tote bag which I haven't actually got any at the moment because I sold out of them at Hyper Japan and then black earrings well I need to restock them too um, and I'm probably not going to take sort them out until after Comic Con actually um, I'll probably wait with them I'll see I'll have a think about it but they definitely won't be going up in the shop update and then Oh, I also have a duck mug as well. I've probably got one of them lying around somewhere that I can take a photo of. So there's not a huge amount of stuff that I need to upload to the website, but there's something. But there's some things, um, and I think it'd be nice just to do a little shop update. So everything is up to date. <laughs> in Henley right now. I've been here for about five days now. Uh, I've settled in quite well. I've got a nice little flat to myself. It's very small but you know it's cute and it does the job for a month. Henley is a really nice little village. It's really pretty here and everyone has been so nice. So as it's the weekend I have some time off. I've been doing a lot of bit, bits and pieces on my book and I've also edited a video and got that out. But I think for the rest of the day I'm actually going to be working on designing some new products. So um, I want to design a lanyard um, and then I also want to design some new blind mystery gashapon uh, prizes. So I think I'm going to do the lanyard first and then work on these new key rings. And I also want to design a new Barbie sticker too but I think that one can wait because I need to send off the product design to and get them made whereas the stickers I make myself so I can do all that later. So it's more important I get the other stuff done first. I'm going to be using my little duck design to create the lanyard, so it's just going to be of him pretty much. Um, I might add a few extra bits and pieces in there, but I don't really want to do 
too much with it because I like the duck so much already. Terrible things started happening when you walked away. So that's why I stay right here. Cause when all of my dreams seem so out of reach, your crystal clear. You don't disappear, baby. No. So why would I? I'm a little bit nervous to see how these keyrings turn out. They're a little bit different to things I've done before and setting up the files is a little bit more complicated because they're mostly just like the plain background of the key acrylic keyring. But uh, hopefully they should work and should look really good. Um, I've placed an order for them and the lanyards so they should be arriving hopefully well before Comic Con in October. I'm actually surprised I managed to get so much done stuff done today. I've still got a little bit of time left. It's about five o'clock so I think I'm gonna sit down and edit some photos and possibly even do a really small little shop update. Uh, I've got a few products that need adding to my website. Um, the Fox enamel pin, the duck mug, cushion and tote bag, um, and then the three new stickers I designed last time. So not a huge amount, but just little bits and pieces. Um, but I think I could do that pretty quickly and get that up and sorted. So I might as well do that tonight and then I'll probably start working on my children's book. Um, do a few hours of that and then tomorrow probably start designing the Barbie sticker um, if I end up doing nothing again. Uh, so yeah, overall it's been a pretty productive day and I'm really happy with what I've managed to get done. Um, and hopefully I'll get more done over the next few weeks while I'm away and have a little bit more free time to do stuff. So why would I So here are all of the new products. There are only nine of them. So it was a very small update, but they are up there now if you want to go and grab some of them. It's been a long week in Henley, but I finally got some time to sit down to design this Barbie sticker. I'm going to be drawing her in her pink dress. Uh, I want it to be really, really fun. So yeah, let's get started with it. I'm really nearing the end of my time here in Henley. I've actually only got one full day left tomorrow. Um, I've had a really good time here and it's been really fun to do, but I am looking forward to going home. So uh, today I'm gonna be designing some graphics. I want to get some stickers made for my mystery bags. I've already designed the key rings. You saw me make them earlier in this video and I'm waiting for them to arrive. But I've also gone and ordered some of my fruit bats um, as some acrylic pins too. Everyone seems to love the fruit bats, which I sell as magnets and stickers. So I thought I'd offer another range of products, that being 
the pins. So they're going to be mystery pins. You'll just get one. Um, you'll get one at random. I just thought it'd be more interesting that people got them randomly rather than you picking out your favourite. So these are going to be in little boxes, like those little pillow boxes. And I need to make a sticker to put on the front of them. Here are the finished designs. So these are gonna be quite small stickers, but I think you'll be able to kind of clearly see what's in each box. I've used the illustrations just to see how that does. If it doesn't work, I'll take some photos, but I just think having the illustrations might work better. Um, I'll have a think about it, but yeah, this is what I've gone for anyway. So this one is for the Frosted Friends, and this one is for the Acrylic Bats. I'm quite happy with how they've come out. Um, and hopefully they'll say a lot to them. I am going to end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have enjoyed it, please don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up and subscribe or hit the notification bell if you're new here. So you'll be the first to be notified for when I next upload. My shop and social media is all linked down below in the description if you want to go and check that out. Obviously, I just did a very small shop update, but if you want to grab any of my new products or any of my old ones, you can on my website, polygonillustration.com. Leave a comment below, let me know what you've liked about this video. Um, yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.